No, there's nothing over here. They said south of Asgard, huh? On a peninsula. Don't get too I don't think we can get there from here. Get him. Blame your fate. Okay. So here's Asgard, peninsula south. Yeah, there's a whole mountain there. As you can see, that's where the Tower of Salvation is. Um, so yeah, I'm pretty sure we won't be able to get that that one until we're able to fly later. So let's uh, rescue the unicorn real quick. That's what we're here to do. And again, this is just the order I'm doing things in. You don't have to, you know, exactly do it the way I'm doing it. I just feel like it's more efficient to do it this way. The unicorn can only be approached by a pure maiden. At the very least, Lloyd Genus and I are up. He's pretty picky if he'll only talk to girls. So then just rain and I'll just stay behind. Collect go by yourself. You saying I'm not qualified? Qualified? I see in the other games what they mean by pure maiden is virgin. And they probably actually said virgin in Japanese. Like you that's what it means by pure maiden. You can't uh you know, have had sex. So that's pretty much Rain admitting, you know, no, she's not a virgin. Which, you know, she's 25 in ancient times, but I'm sure and she's already her midlife crisis. Martel? You mean the goddess? No, you're not Martel. You just have her DNA or whatever. This is used to cure Martel's sickness. It's alright, I'll be fine. Oh, I see, you're the chosen of regeneration. Take it. There was a unicorn thing in Tales of Fantasia as well, but I don't remember exactly what happened to me. What's wrong? Our horns are our very lives. My destiny is now fulfilled. So the unicorn is dead. You knew? And when the unicorn loses its horn, it dies. By dying, a new unicorn is born. That's why the unicorn is a symbol of death and rebirth. Will the new unicorn be born? Yes, probably. I hope so. Well, Unicorn can save Flood. No. I have to become chosen. I have to become an angel. Blah, blah, blah. This one here. Like, yeah, this is not like a story playthrough or anything like that. So if you're disappointed, I don't know this. It's a lot of text to read. Like, you know, we've been spoiled by more recent RPGs where everything's voice acted. Like, it's uh, it's pretty rough on the old uh, the old pipes, especially if you're a soft-spoken person like myself. And you know, I can't really experience the story for you. Like, you know, if you're playing along with this, it's kind of up to you to you know experience the story and the character arcs for yourself. Whenever me and um, Caleb are playing during the first half of the stream, like, it's just sort of us reminiscing about old times, and we're not really fully paying attention to the story either, like, we're kind of making fun of it and stuff like that. Get away! Ooh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Dodge and weave. But yeah, we gotta... Oh. You're in real stupid world of skit hurt. title pop up and start. I messed up. Sonic Light Spear! Rock! Get him! Lightning! Sonic Double Demon Fang! Sonic White Spear! Yeah! Work with me! Oh, over already? Okay.
And even though, like, in this playthrough, we're not getting, like, I'm not actually reading all of the skip points that we're finding on the map, like, I'll show you where they are, so if you want to raise your affection with a certain character, you can do that. But we kind of decided that we're gonna pick Sheena as the soulmate for this playthrough, so... We'll mostly be going for options that increase our affection with her. So yeah, now we're back on this side of the continent. This is where Isold is. Um, if you try to cross the bridge, like you can technically do the Not game backwards, like do the fourth seal second and the third seal. Fourth seal. Second. I guess the third seal stays the third seal. You just swap basically the second and fourth place. So you could do Tower of Mana, Asgard, and then come back and do um, uh, the water seal. Not only do you make the game harder for yourself, but like if you're going for like a Sheena affection kind of run. Um, that's the way to get max affection with her if you're starting from zero. Colette, mm -hmm. are you sure this is what you want? Not using the unicorn horn, I mean, you're the one that went and got it. Blah, blah, blah. Not important. So we're gonna switch you out for you. We are now going to fight the Sword Dancer. Uh, you could fight him really early, but it, unless you have like some light magic, it's going to it's going to be difficult regardless. He hits really freaking hard, but uh, this is a good time to fight him. You have this. up until right before you leave for the Tower of Salvation to fight him. If you don't fight him before then, uh, you completely miss out on doing his side quest, so you're going to want to do this before you finish up Follow me. Air thrust. No, dear. I was referring to the species. Oh. My, my, you're so dumb. I wait next time. Yata Mirror. I never expected to run into an enemy like that. He was huge. I bet he lived in a big house before he became a skeleton. Yeah, whatever. So the Yata Mirror is a freaking nice... Uh, what do you call it? Accessory. So what it does is while you're wearing it, you have it equipped in battle, you're constantly regenerating 3% of your maximum health and your maximum mana, so... I like putting those on casters because they're standing around a lot of the time anyway. But yeah, that fight can be really, really tough if you do it early. It is really only doable early if you have the right tools to deal with them. You're gonna regret this! Not impossible. <laughs> And you hardly have like any items. Hold on. Hold on. But if you're looking for a more your fate. difficult fight, go ahead and fight him as soon as you finish fighting Sheena. Or, you know, go heal and easel and then come back and fight him at least. Don't get too cut. Blame your fate. Ooh, another beast fang and some more cabbage. Mm. 
Martel is a goddess, right? That's what they call her. I mean, I guess I could summarize the game's story, like, towards the end, but... Reading through it is just... I don't have the energy. I'm more of a deadpan person. I'm crazy. I'll do crazy voices every once in a while if the mood takes me. Most of the time, the mood isn't taking me. Blame your fate. Okay. Oh shit! I should have went to Isol. There's a there's a dog there. We need a name for a clip. You're gonna regret. See what I mean about uh, not being able to cast two mid tier spells? Rain was stuck casting, you know, Photon forever. Okay, good. Looks like the path, the trail wasn't blocked off. At some point, there'll be a guy standing there saying, like, oh, you, you can't go through, there's a blockage. Blame your fate. Yeah, it looks like he. Well, we'll see. He'll be right here if that's the case. Nope, I made it through. Okay, so there's that dog in tree, yeah, tree that I need to go and name real quick. I mean, it's not even a good title, I don't know why you want to get it, just in case you want to get it, I'll show you. Just in case. She can't do her dog missions once uh, once we do the last seal because she won't be able to talk. So be be warned. And this little cutie feels like Cammy. His tail is so cute. Yeah. Oh, we should. Yeah. I was gonna buy some groceries, but it's not completely necessary. Okay, there's one more dog we can get over here. I'm trying to think. There is one in Iselia, but we can't name that one now for obvious reasons. We're exiled, so. Uh, there's this one. There was a one in Triad that we just got. There's one in Izul that I need to hopefully remember to um, go and get as well. Let me see. There are four summon spirits per area. So we got Sylph, Undine, this is Ifrit that we're going to get right here. Yes, the setup is much better. Oh, that's so dumb. I knew I should have taken the time to make that bridge work properly. It just got hotter. Yes, it is. Focus on the battle level. Who cares? Don't worry. He's not a super hard fight, but you do have to watch out because uh, when he casts Explosion, it will bring whoever gets hit by it down to like 1 HP. It's kind of, kind of nuts. Um, 
Not super hard of a fight, just be on your toes. Okay, I'll give it a shot. The last one we can't do, it's a summon spirit of light. We won't be able to do that for quite a while. Quite a while. So we got all the summon spirits done on this side. That we can get any. We've I've shown all the skip points except for one for Genus. It's it's by here I can show you the now. You who possess the right of the pact. I am one who is bound to meet those. I am Sheena. I seek a pact with Ifri. I ask that thou annulst thy pact with Mythos and establish a new pact with me. I shall test whether you are worthy of forming a pact. My fire will render everything to ashes. Burn to ashes. Really quickly. Are you okay? Ready? 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 Such a good song. Your power is admirable. Speak your vow. Right now, at this very moment, I ask thou to grant me thy power. I bestow upon you my raging inferno. Not too bad. He's he's dangerous if you don't stay on top of your health, but Yeah, the Japanese version they got extra attacks like that. That attack that he just did where he put his hand on the ground and shot up a giant fire beam. That was so cool, Sheena. Man, I wish I could conjure summon spirits too. And say cool things like burn to oblivion. Knowing Lloyd, he's more likely to end up setting one of us on fire. And what's that supposed to mean? Exactly what I said, moron. But yeah, it's uh it's cute. It's cute. The characters, they're well voice acted. Like, yeah, Genus has a couple of, you know, funny, awkward dialogue, but for the most part, everybody's, like, well acted, and they got really good voice actors to do the acting. Like, the fact that that, uh, what's his name? Darren something or other, the guy who voices Cosmo from, Dar like, Fairly Odd Parents. Like, he's so good in it. Like, he's so good as Rodile. He's so good as, a. Uh, just random design henchman number 451, like the spellcasters. Like, that's, that's good. Really good. It's just too bad that, you know, when they localized the Japanese version to English, they sort of either they were pressed for time, money, or both, so. Came out sounding not as good. Alright, so. We got that done. Uh, let me see. The genus skip point is like over here. I'm not gonna get it though. Just thought I'd. Oh dang it! Not much of a specimen. You're gonna be kidding me! It's over. Thunderblade. Sword. You picked the wrong guy to mess with. 
Let's see, I forgot that we were kind of in shambles after that. Recover. Nurse. And actually, it's a bad idea to do it out of combat because we definitely need her to get Nurse up to, um... Where is it? It's not here. It's like behind the mountain over here. I think it is. It's around here somewhere. Suckers. East of Acelia House of Salvation. So this is the Acelia Salvation right here, so east of it would be over here. Oh yeah, I remember now. Like you really have no reason to come all the way back. Oh, don't touch me, but yeah, it's right there in the distance. You're in for a world of hurt. <laughs> Are you okay? First day. <laughs> Never stood a chance. Okay, but yeah, it's right over here. 